Today we have three trucks inside our box. Let's see the first one. Kids, do you know what this is? If you said it's a backhoe, you're right. This is one of our favorite trucks. This is a JCB backhoe from Bruder Trucks. It's got a lot of really cool detail. Let's check out some of the things on it. Now I know you're thinking we need to get to shoveling, but first we need to put the stabilizers down. Oh, that one was stuck. There goes the other one. What do backhoes do? Do you know? Well, before we answer, let me ask you something else. Now I know you like surprises, but do you like messy surprises? Well, now we can test out what the backhoe is for. Look how it has a bucket scoop on it. Can you guess what we're going to do with it? By moving this silver piece, we can move the bucket up and down into position. It's ready to scoop now. Kids, do you know what color this backhoe is? What color do you think it is? If you said yellow, you are right! Great job! Yellow, yellow, yellow backhoe! Let's take a view from the top. Here we go, into position. Shovel is ready. Bucket is ready. Scoop. Lift. And what does this lever do? What do you think it does, kids? It does that. Did anyone notice how silly it was that I put the stabilizers down? Those stabilizers make it hard to move the truck. They're supposed to help stick it in place. It's just a toy though. Now we come to the really fun digger. The actual backhoe part. Watch how we can scoop the load. See it bends at the boom and the stick. You can pick stuff up. Drop it out. One nice thing about this truck when you play with it is you can grab it by the backhoe and pull it along. All right, bye, Mr. Backhoe. What a mess. What do you think I've got that can help clean it? Can you guess? Wow, what kind of truck is that? Do you know? If you said that it's a small bulldozer, you're right. Look at the bulldozer go. What color is this bulldozer, kids? This is a yellow bulldozer. It's a caterpillar bulldozer. What's special about a bulldozer, kids? Well, I can think of two things. One, it has a big blade on the front. And two, it has tracks. 
Let's check out this toy in action. Let's put down the blade, and here we go. Look at this big pile of junk the bulldozer made. What are we going to do with it? I wonder if truck number three could help. What do you think truck number three is going to be? Wow, look at this dirty truck. What do you think it is? Here are some clues. It has big fat tires. It's got a big bucket with a claw on it. And it's really, really good at loading. Do you know what it is? This truck is a front loading tractor. This is another brooder truck. This one is a Kloss. What are the colors on this tractor? It looks orange, green, black, and even some white. Do you remember what colors the other trucks were? Do you remember? What were they? If you said that the other trucks were yellow, you remembered really well. Great job! Let's see this truck in some more action. Here it goes to scoop up the load. Okay kids, those are our three trucks from our surprise box today. Did you like them? Did you guess what they have in common too? Did you? Well there's probably lots of things that we can say, but they're all dirty! Look at that one. Look at those dirty tracks. We like to play with these trucks outside in the dirt. Check out some of our other videos to see them in action. What are you doing to Jack's poor backhoe? We're making them mud masks. Okay, yeah. let's wash them off. Yep, gotta wash them off now. Gonna wash these I have to make this. Can I roll the wires from me? Watch this, kids. Shh. Okay, excavator, I need you to dig up all this dense black sand from my face. Sure. This is what happens when these girls play with trucks. It's a little bit freaky. <laughs> Welcome to Jack 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 Plays with Matias. All right, guys, we're here at the beach, and we've got trucks. Let's dig. Matias, what kind of truck do you got there? It's an excavator. Jack, what's that you've got? 
excavator. You've got the same excavator. We've got two of them. The leave hair wheeled excavator. Let's see what Matthias is making here. It looks like he is digging a trench. Jack says he's gonna make a digger deeper trench while Matthias makes a long one. Dig out the soil and dig. We are actually a little ways away from the beach by a giant tide pool that almost looks like a lake. The rest of the beach and the ocean is past that bridge. I'm digging this pool up. That is some fast excavator action, wow. Is that so deep? So deep. That's Jack Jack in the green. That's T-Dog in the red. Matthias is T-Dog. T-Dog, woof. This is getting a really big pile. Oh my god. I just piled Look how deep mine is. I am making I'm getting all set for seconds. And I'm digging the foundation. Alright, we're digging the foundations for our mega sand castle. I'm the big backhoe. It, it has to be switched to the backhoe. Because it has to load this big truck. <laughs> Whoa, that is a huge scoop. Does that truck have enough power? It yep. does. Yo, T-Dog, what's that you're using? It's a front loader. Look at that scoop into this beautiful sand. It's so soft. My truck's full. My truck is full. We broke our real dump truck, so we are using a flatbed truck, but it works just fine here on the beach. Yeah! Uh oh, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen, Jack? Is there gonna be some dumping? Whoa, great dump. Beep, 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 backing into position. We've got some bulldozer action now. Oh, are you getting worn out? You're working so hard. Matthias is one of Jack's best friends, and we came with his family to the beach. Uh, Guys, it's a truck emergency! Put it back up! Don't let it crash! Ah, there it is. There's the low spot. It just, the earth cracks, so we have to fill in. Ah. The earth cracked. Oh. Beep. Beep. Beep, 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 beep. Here comes the tea dog. I'll have to fill this truck up, because Hey, Jackie, keep stepping on my truck. Stop stepping on my truck. I'm trying to scoop up this hole. was complete then. Customers far away. We need to fill in some holes. 
because that's important. Let's see you can be far away. This truck is all full. This truck is all full now. All full. Get the switch. Now, dump it. Flop. So, so I can go what? The dirt has to be all the same size, so all the dirt can finally run through the hole. So I have to do this hole around the base. So I have to dig the moat by using that. My wheels must be stable. I need some help digging out the, the big parts of this. and dig out the moat we found. There goes Ruthie. There's Celeste. I don't want to get muddy. Oh, you're succeeding in getting muddy. Muddy, muddy. Oh, we found a puddle that's filling with water. Or a hole that's filling with water, making a big puddle. I have to make this puddle. This puddle. Because I need all the water to come in. Yeah. I'm too making this. What are you building now? We're building a pile of sticks. Wow, look at all this driftwood. Really cool pile, guys. We're taking a break from our sandcastle for just a little bit. Yeah, because we're building this. Here he comes. Do we get hundreds of sticks? Hundreds of sticks. There's thousands of sticks here. And these are logs, not just sticks. Load them up, T Dog. This is so slimy, kids. Oh, it's like I'm stepping in. I, I don't know what. It's really freaky feeling.
The boys are back in action. They needed to plow around their giant pile. Yeah, right, boys? Yeah. Kids, would you like to be here with Jack and Matthias? I bet you would. Look at that. Look at that, kids. Look how hard T is working. If it falls this way, this can save it from falling. This is the balance of Kids, you can imagine uh -oh. you're right here in between Matthias and... Oh no! What happened? The tread fell off. It's okay. It's easy to get back on. It's a nice thing about Tonka's is they're tough and they're pretty easy to fix. As I was saying, kids, you could fit right in here with your truck and help them push the sand up into the side of the pile. I don't want leaking part edges that That's right. we need to fill them in. We don't want edges. Now the girls are at it. Look at the slime kids, it's freaky. Ah. Can you even hear that, I wonder? Whoa, check out this mud that the girls are in. It's, it might be tar, we don't it's, know. It is tar. Oh, I don't know. Little black sand. Mom said it was tar. Oh, maybe, I don't know. Really Some beaches around here definitely have tar, but it's not sticking to my feet. Or is it? Watch this, kids. Shh. Oh my goodness, Celeste found a crab! <laughs> Shoveling up the crabs. Bye, Mr. Crabby, go back to your mud. This is the best face mask. It's cod. I'd like to see you do it. Okay. What do you think your mom and dad would think? Oh, go all the way. Okay, excavator, I need you to dig up all this dense black sand for my face. Sure. Let's dig. It smells really bad. This is what happens when these girls play with trucks. It's a little bit freaky. What are you doing to Jack's poor backhoe? We're making them M mud masks. The okay, yeah. let's wash them off. Yep, gotta wash them off now. I'm gonna wash these things. See how deep this is, kids? <laughs> it's so deep. Not. All clean. All clean. Wait, use a headband. Oh, a seaweed headband, how cute. All right, Mama, show these kids how it's done. Probably not like that. Yeah, not like that. Okay, let's see, let's see. Oh, God, it's too hard. Oh, uh, yeah, a piece has snapped off of that. Try the other truck. All right, well, Look. you guys in the audience think you know why the sand is black and you agree it's tar or disagree, let us know in the comments. It's dirty, whatever it is. Cool. This is a microbial blanket. Yes, this is, the, like here you can see where like there's like the pieces of the green, it's a microbial blanket and the tide. Cool. Flat. Wow, the kids are really gonna learn something today. I know. It's really tough. Thick. Must be tough. Kids, can you see the bird on the beach? In the wood? It's coming to check out the snacks that we brought. It's keeping a safe distance though. So I want to get anywhere where near Jack Jack and Matias. Bye kids for watching Jack and Matias. Well, they are trying to tell you thanks for watching kids. Don't forget to give us a like. 
and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Bye. D Doritoing you. D Dorito face action. Better? <laughs>